our viewers. We all want to stay fit and disease free. And for that, your immune system should be working at its best. The stronger your immunity, the safer you'll be from catching infections. You'll be able to fight off illness more efficiently. So how do you bolster your immunity naturally? There must be ways to strengthen your body's natural defenses. In today's video, we'll discuss several ways to improve your immune system. Can laughing really make your body stronger? Why should you drink more water? We'll be discussing all of these and more. To begin with, laugh as much as you can. Do you laugh a lot? Well, if you don't, you now have a reason. Laughing is great for your health. We have all heard the saying, laughter is the best medicine. It's not just something people say though. Frequently laughing can help improve your immune system and keep you healthy. A study showed people funny videos to monitor the effects of laughing on the immune system. The results showed that participants' immune systems who laughed out loud worked better than the others. This doesn't mean you have to sit and watch funny videos every day, although it doesn't hurt. Even spending time with your friends would help you laugh a lot. Experts suggest it is 30 times more likely we'll laugh when we're around friends. Next up, you need to make sure you drink a lot of water. How many glasses of water do you drink in a day? Have you ever monitored your daily water intake? It might sound irrelevant to you, but the amount of daily water you drink can improve your overall health. Staying hydrated is vital in keeping yourself protected from germs and viruses. When you're dehydrated, you'll have various issues such as problems with kidney function, headaches, and digestion difficulties. These complications can mean you'll be more prone to illness. The best way to stay hydrated is by drinking water regularly. Water doesn't have calories or added sugar, as would be the case with other liquids such as carbonated drinks. Beverages such as tea and fruit juice can help you stay hydrated but should be limited. These beverages contain higher amounts of sugar, which can end up causing other health issues. Drink plenty of water to quench your thirst. People who do intense exercises will need a lot more water. Older individuals also need to drink water regularly even when they're not thirsty. Getting a pet may have surprisingly pleasant effects on your health. A dog is said to be man's best friend, and with good reason. Having a dog as a pet improves your physical and mental health. Since you need to walk your dog regularly, you'll also get physical exercise with your furry friend. Playing with your dog and gaining their affection improves your mood, especially when you return from a hard day's work. If you have a child at home, a dog can help build their immune system and make them less likely to have allergies. It's not just a dog, though. Any pet you have will give you a lot of health benefits. Pet owners generally have lower blood pressure and cholesterol levels, which keep their hearts healthy. You'll need to keep your stress levels low. If you want to boost your immunity, you should reduce your stress and anxiety levels as much as possible. In the current world we live in, that may be hard to do, but your immunity system takes a hit when you stress too much. If you're under stress for an extended period, it will cause a flare-up in inflammation. It also ends up causing an imbalance in the functionality of your immunity cells. You can do various stress management activities, including meditation and yoga. Other practices that can help your stress are journaling and exercise. If you're still unable to manage your stress, you should consider consulting a therapist to help. Watch your alcohol intake if you want your immunity to be stronger. When you go out with your friends or family, alcohol is involved more often than not. It would be best if you tried to limit your alcohol consumption to a minimum. Limiting your alcohol intake at a party or social gathering to one or two drinks would greatly help your overall health. Drinking too much alcohol can weaken your body's defenses. You would end up falling sick a lot more frequently. We don't mean you can bank your drinks either and blow them all on one rager. You should reduce the number of occasions you end up with a drink in your hand. Drinking alcohol in large quantities can directly suppress a wide range of immune responses. Alcohol abuse is also directly linked with a number of infectious diseases. Sleep peacefully at night to stay healthy and fit. Maybe this sounds a little too exciting for lazy people like me, but did you know you can actually boost your immunity by sleeping soundly at night? Sleep plays an essential role in your fitness. When you sleep, your body takes the opportunity to work on itself and repair whatever damage has occurred throughout the day. It also gives most of your organs a chance to take some well-deserved rest. It's no wonder that getting enough sleep is linked with a robust immune system. A study on more than 160 healthy adults had one group sleep for six hours or more, while the other group slept for six hours or less. The group with more rest was less likely to catch a cold than the other group. Not all of us can fall asleep quickly, though. People struggling to fall asleep should try mindfulness steps, such as reducing screen time at least an hour before sleeping. The blue light that comes off these screens can mess with your circadian rhythm and disturb your sleep cycle. 
You need to quit smoking if you want your immune system to work at its best. Cigarettes and tobacco are known causes of lung cancer and throat cancer. While the nicotine gets you addicted to the cigarette, the tobacco and the tar can damage your immune system. You may find it hard to give up on cigarettes because the nicotine in them helps release dopamine to the body, making you feel good. Once you become dependent on nicotine to give you your dopamine hit, your body craves more cigarettes. But if you give in, you would only be destroying your overall health for a temporary dopamine hit. Since your immune system also takes a hit, you would be more susceptible to falling ill and ruining your quality of life. Reducing added sugars in your diet can help a lot. Your diet should be devoid of added sugars and refined carbs, as they are the leading cause of obesity. When you put on more than your ideal weight, your body becomes more likely to fall sick. A study among 1,000 people showed participants who were obese and got the flu vaccine were twice as likely to get the disease compared to those who weren't obese and got the vaccine. When you reduce sugar content in your body, you can prevent your body from inflammation and also help in shedding some weight. Reducing sugar consumption also lowers the chances of chronic disease such as diabetes and cardiovascular issues. People with diabetes and heart diseases will have weaker immune systems, making them susceptible to more infections. In such cases, it is more than necessary to reduce your sugar intake and boost your immune system's performance. The sugar content in your diet should be as low as 5% of your calorie consumption. Typically, this would amount to 25 grams or two tablespoons of sugar for a person who has a diet amounting to 2,000 calories. Wash your hands diligently to help your immune system. Something as simple as regularly washing your hands can help strengthen your immune system. Since your hands are perhaps the most active parts of your body, there's a high likelihood of germs being on them due to contact with many different surfaces. When you put your hands on your face, you raise the risk of germs entering your body and weakening your immune system. Consistently washing your hands will eliminate these germs, allowing your immune system to concentrate on more severe attacks. Ideally, use antibacterial soap when you're washing your hands. If you don't have soap, hand sanitizer will do as well. You must wash your hands for at least 20 seconds to gain the maximum benefit. Eating immunity-boosting foods can be a game changer. One of the most effective ways to strengthen your body's natural defenses is by eating natural immune-boosting foods. Wondering what those are? Let's take a quick look. Citrus fruits like orange, grapefruit, and clementines contain vitamin C. Why is that necessary? Because this particular vitamin increases the production of white blood cells. It is these white blood cells that fight off infections. Don't like eating citrus fruits? No worries. You can opt for red bell peppers and broccoli. They too are rich sources of vitamin C. Make sure you don't deep fry them or cook them in high heat, especially broccoli. It's best to eat them on their own or steam. Research has shown that steaming is the best way to keep nutrients intact in the food. If you love adding a little zing to your food, reach out for garlic. Not just for taste, but for the health benefits as well. Garlic has a rich concentration of allicin, which is a sulfur-rich compound. It's believed garlic's immune-boosting properties come from this compound. Stronger immunity is crucial for your health. Interested in knowing some home remedies that can help you keep fit? Or foods that you should eat on the daily to stay healthy? Let's keep the conversation going with a couple more health-related videos, shall we? Watch six easy home remedies for a stronger immune system. You can also try our video on 16 alkaline foods you must have in your daily diet. Go ahead, click one, or better yet, watch both and learn more about staying healthy. Are you planning on implementing any of these immunity-boosting suggestions? Let us know in the comments below.